Put pets in there. Is it your pet snake? That um, our friend saw. this camera makes me question is my face wonky i don't know if the ears are slightly off or it's the parting that's like an optical illusion but i feel like i'm a bit on the wonk i shouldn't be but that's what we're working with okay good morning this is calamity calling and today i'm playing the ace attorney the case of the unbreakable speckled band part two we're going to go into the room where the maybe actually is a russian person is with the snake but then her lock shrooms are still going to assume i did it because uh, apparently a very obviously asian man is a russian person who is planning uh coup or, or something i i feel like he's the golden retriever boy in all of this like he's he's cute but he he's not that bright which is you know i mean what do we expect really but let's play press the any button uh today i'm choosing the any button as my x button continue yes it's always very decisive, that stampy noise, isn't it? Uh, no, I spoke about all the things with him. Let's move. First class passageway. Oh, hang on. Let me make myself smaller, because as much as I love my face, the game thing is a bit more important than me. But only a little bit, mind you. First class cabin passageway. If that's picked up by the mic, I'm going to put that on there. That's the seagulls. I have to live with that noise. I hate them. I hate seagulls so much. I've just noticed that none of them seem to really turn. They just kind of rotate on the spot. You know, like um, NPCs in fighting games where they're just like... Just realised my chair squeaks at the same time. I promise it's the chair. I was living in a wardrobe. You lot need to chill. I think that, apart from the fact that his thighs seem to be cutting through the rest of him, I think it's the man spreading he's doing that's probably why he looks quite so large. That's a good idea. be so damn mean I've been in a bloody wardrobe oh goodness <laughs> oh bless me If this bitch is being sarcastic right now. Uh, she's still not in my good books after the amount of time she smacked me last time. Examine! Uh, there are things over there, but I'm curious about this mousetrap. They exist, yes. 
Not even cheese. Is cheese not a thing in Japan? Can anyone answer that? Because if it's not, I'm sorry. Cheese is delicious. Let, let, let us just take a moment to feel sorry for this individual who has never experienced the joy of cheese. It is truly a delight of every form of dairy, and there are many, and I'm even considering ice cream. Cheese is the best form. Please do let me know in the comments if you agree with me. And if you don't agree with me, you are entitled to your opinion, but I think you're wrong. But please do tell me your favorite form of dairy. It tastes like heaven. What? Oh my god, I thought you were saying I couldn't eat cheese. Oh, that was a sad moment for me. But I like cheese. No? Sad times. Sad, sad times. I hate her a little less now. I like people who feed me. I'm basically a cat. Like, I won't... I don't necessarily trust you. But I'll let you pet me. But if you feed me, we can be friends. Ooh, ding dong. very pleasing shape isn't it is it because it looks like a boob see now I want to touch it more totally don't want to press I would call this an emergency I want to press the bell really want to spoil sport yeah. That is the look a mother gives a kid who has been told no, but still tries to do the thing. You don't get to give me that look, lady. No. Fun. She's just not letting me have any fun, is she? Oh wait, I don't want to go in there yet. <sighs> oh jeez, why? Why do they not have? Oh, hang on. Theory, not his clothes. He stole them from an actual member of cabin staff, and that's why they don't fit him. Why is his face stripy? Um... Whoa, dude's been eating his spinach. How? How do his trousers not split whenever he sits down? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-mm. All he needs is a staff and a pointy hat. Fine, I'll look over here. What does this say? I wonder if Burya means anything. What is this magic uh, d uh, word, word, word? Not dictionary, not thesaurus, encyclopedia. What is this magic encyclopedia that just has every answer we need? Can I have one? I would like to know how to do tax. Yes. It's to do with buoyancy. You, it's fun fact. Mm, it's fun to me anyway. You could float in a bath made of concrete as long as um, as long as it's wide enough on the bottom. Basically, you need enough surface area that um, the air will, you know, lift, kind of thing. Um, but anything can float. Just needs to be the right shape. 
if she's going to give a you know like a definition that or a, a way of it that's completely proves that I'm wrong. I don't know what that word is, but I've seen it before. Aha! Thank you. Totally. Okay, what is this? Oh, I can't look at it. I want that. It's a nice colour. Yes, let me in. Is it not in your language? Ooh. Because he's not. Also, do not presume someone's handwriting just from their function. I think I have terrible handwriting and yet I've been writing and have been paid to write throughout my entire life. Still terrible handwriting. Yeah, someone calls me rough and ready. I'm taking it as an insult. Weird. Mm-hmm. Sounds fishy to me. Right. You, sir. May we have a discuss? Why? Why does his face look like a bratwurst? I want to see him crush a can. Why is he so mean? Oh, no one's directly dissed her yet, so let's see what this goes. Please, please have a super mean side. Please be a viper in a pretty wrapper. I'm not sailor. Hang on, let's get... Mother gave me name. That was terrible, I'm sorry. I am Senior Kuman Bistroganov. <laughs> oh my god, I just got his name. Beef Stroganov. Delicious. But... I think your mum hates you. Yeah, no one's getting through you. Huh. So he's guarding kings and queens, but they can't give him an outfit that fits. Is that why he hates me? <laughs> oh god. Thank you! Da. Oh, come on, this... This is not like we're trying to program. It cannot be both yes and no. We are not quantum computers. It is one or the other, which I know it means yes. I really should continue learning Russian. I keep getting into it and then I get distracted and life happens and I fall out of it again. Is this like vampires? Tantalizing is a food word. Ooh, hang on. Last night first. Ah. 
I just realised he doesn't have eyebrows, and now I can't unsee it. Hmm. Yet. Hey, she's learning. Is this the sailor doth protest too much? Dude's lying. It's the first time he's not met my eyes. Please crack a walnut with your bicep. I just noticed how well done the shadows on his shirt are to where the muscle definition would be. Well done to the artist here. I also just noticed that his tie is a little fish. Mm-hmm. Tell me more about this man. Is this actually the Russian dude? Grims Grimsby Roylot. Grimsby. I'm I'm pretty sure every name is a joke here, but I'm not catching them all. What Grim Mr. Grimsby Roylot. Grimsby Roylot. Someone can tell me what what the joke in that one is, please do. Grimsby Roylot. Hmm. Staler doth protest too much. That means absolutely bugger all. Authentic Western gentlemen historically have done many bad things all over the world. So let's not use that as a character reference. He was not a lowly student, and the Far East Islands are not insignificant. You have a very Western-centric view of the world, sir, and it is not favourable. Ooh. You know when you drink too much coffee in a day and all of a sudden your heart starts pounding? I think that's where I'm at now. I should stop drinking coffee. <sighs> or just breathe, th breathe through the palpitations. That's what we do here. <sighs> idea. Um, gameplay. Off. On. Oh. I thought... Never mind, I thought I could make the text go a bit faster. Why is his face stripy? Why will no one tell me that? He literally looks like a bratwurst. Is, th is that a Russian sausage? I feel like it's an Eastern European sausage, but I don't know if it's specifically Russian. It might be German. Is this yes all right, but I'm going to sneak out? Is that a genuine phrase in Russia? When the lobster whistles on top of the mountain? He's saying never, basically. did not like her. I guess I've got to examine the door again before it'll let me in. <laughs> I'm a super spy. 
Cause I'm an international super spy Super spy Hello, would you like some cookies? Hmm, but her lock's over there already, isn't he? Oh, come on. Who says they have to be there for us to investigate? Uh-oh. Was it her lock? Is she gonna boot the door open? Oh. Oh wait, he's on this side. I, th I thought he was already in there, honestly. Ah! Oh, but I don't think he knows how precisely you have to kick a door to put it off its hinges. You literally need to hit the bit under the handle. Otherwise, unless it's a really crappy door, you're not getting in. That won't work. Door's not even locked. What prey can I kick? Let's just go in. Ah, what are we seeing? What are we seeing? Who's dead? Who else is dead? I should say. Oh! Hey, he's the dude from the picture! And why is his thingy fallen down? Oh, hang on. Hang on. First thing I noticed, that picture... You can't see where I'm pointing. Uh, in the middle of the thing, that looks slightly different than the rest of everything. Yeah, this, this looks like an actual Russian and I could be stereotyping because of the hat. Don't- Ah, it's just as much as mittens! Mmm, the trailer leads me to believe there is someone in that suitcase. Oh yeah, I'm on the other side of the door. I was like, why isn't the thingy over there? Because it's over there. No! He is not Mr. Grimsby Roylot. Nah. Bull. That's no Grimsby. He said he was a proper Western gentleman. No one's heard of you, dude. Chill. <laughs> Oh, it is actually him, never mind. Oh god, dude looks smug and not in... Dude looks slimy from this angle. Same. Yep. Wasn't the lady in the wardrobe last time, you knob? Many people could. <laughs> I'm a trendsetter. Is that where the snake is? Or is this where the blonde uh, dancer is? No, you won't. He's busy. Blooming wardrobe. Do I have to question him before he'll let me, do you think? Yes. Oi, her lock. Do something. Mm. 
Oh, on a first name basis already, aren't we lucky? so many big personalities in this. Big personalities. No. Stop talking so much and do something. For once. Oh, what's in his pocket? What's in the bin? <gasps> What's in his spin? It were, but, oh, I have so many questions. Why is the thingy falling down? What's in his hand? What's in his trunk? And why is there something inside of his tube thing? Don't know, threaten him with the Kremlin? I think that's not Russian specific in this case. I doubt it. You're not that smart. You've been wrong. Why is there a plate on the floor? Is he going to cut <laughs> this beard off? Is he going to secretly be a fantastic detective who just cocked it up a bit for me? Don't judge a book by its cover. I like this music. It's quite lovely. Okay. He's the one planning the coup. Has he got a thing for facial hair? That or he's going to cut something out of the paper in his pocket. What is wrong with her? He literally said nothing. He's a politician. He said so much, but actually nothing. I agree with you, Mr. Background. I like that. Ineffable twaddle. If you wish to blow smoke up his backside, please do so on your time, not mine. something people will either clarify it or you know their response to you being quite vague will usually give you an answer to a more specific question 
Because, you know, a, a not guilty person never assumes they're guilty of something. It's behaviour that gives someone away. Hang on, I gotta Google what that word means. Elucidate. Make... It just means to explain or make something clear. Dude, there is no need for this level of vocabulary. I get that, like, Sholmes or his, you know, namesake was private, uh, Oxford or Cambridge or something, but like, Jesus Christ, that's unnecessary language. Elucidate, bloody hell. No, just bloody tell me I've had enough of your nonsense. Don't want to. Oh, this is a new feature. The newspaper says who he is. How does he just glide like that? It's because of the picture of the guy in the paper. It looks like him if he has his beard. That's why it's in his pocket. Who does his lighting? I need someone to do that for my life. That's not him. Well, I guess if he thinks he's him, then he knows he's not me. That is quite a copious beard, you are correct. face is completely different. <sighs> Not true. I think he's the guy who helped the Russian girl out. And who's in that picture frame? He's wearing glasses! <sighs> that is true. not that one. Everything that was a question mark is wrong, I'm assuming. Love his coat though, that fur trim looks so toasty. Well that needs the matching collar. Snake. Save for a snake Dumbledore. Oh we did catch that then. She's in the other bag. So it's... <laughs> He's a bit off on everything, isn't he? He's a bit of a special one. Hang on, my hair is bothering me to no end. Stay behind. Problem with having so much hair. There we go, a bit less of it. Oh. 
I don't know what that means either. I know what a coup is, but what's the other word? A glance that takes in a comprehensive view. episode I'll try and do my hair like that as much as I can with this fringe. <sighs> He's wrong. This wasn't kidnapped. She wanted to go. She wasn't happy. I'm assuming. Is that racist? Assuming ending words in ski? Is no one going to take the scissors off this guy? What is it with this game and just letting people casually have large weapons? <sighs> You're wrong. but he still doesn't actually look like him. That's a very specific way to put it. That's still an idea today. change his deductions that seems like fun and save that you know just in case I cock everything up <laughs> yes although I don't like the idea of being tactful this dude needs to be taken down a few pegs his ego ego even is clearly far too large If you could tell from the look of utter the f about like the the look of utter mm -mm, on my face, he shouldn't be questioning this. I really hope he's super serious under all of this, because he's uh, at the moment. I'm not in all right. I'm enjoying his personality, but I'm not enjoying him. Does that make sense? Oh, 
Oh, they're gone. Dance of deduction. You touch me anywhere below the shoulder and I'll smack you. No permission. Do not touch me. I will swing you, strange man. In his Piper opiates, just so you're aware. He's absolutely off his tits right now. Tits isn't a swear word, I don't think. I try not to swear too much. Correct. No, it's not for the beard. No, you wouldn't. You would need very sharp scissors. Because you basically need to get it down to bristles to be able to shave it and... So raise that question. Oh boy, too close. Zoom out. Sneaky devil, it's her. I had not even considered that. I like zoom out. Prosthesis? to go all the way down the back. Oh, piss off. I'm sure that woman has the bone stru structure to look lovely with short hair. I didn't know that the sheen of someone's. Oh, boy. What is it with people's an obsession with long hair? I remember when I first cut my hair from like down to my hips to like heel length. The amount of people I've been to hairdressers who straight up like oh, about like I've just told them I'm going to murder someone, kind of gasping, when I tell them I cut off that much hair. People really are obsessed with long hair, no idea why. Nope, other side of the paper. I mean, not really. I'd like to just point it out rather than keep on talking around the subject, but you do you. I mean, that does sound like fun. 
Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No, nope. heart palpitations, put that down. She's not a revolutionary, she's a dancer. Just like rhythm. You have. Funny that. Uh, let me just check which paper it is. Uh, here you go. Yes! Good for you, lady. You're very good with the gum paste and stuff. You're actually a very pretty young ballerina with a lovely dress. Over. Oh boy, oh god, those scissors. <gasps> oh, it's in the hat, thank god, not the head. You're gonna take the get up off now? Those earrings are gorgeous. Aw, oh, it does have a fluffy collar after all. Nina. Hey, Nina. Of course not. How has her waist suddenly shrunk as well? save because I'm not quite sh sure I'm picking up what he's putting down about the crime she's committing honestly Is she stealing the tiara? Um, I just... <sighs> yeah, it's made of pure diamonds. Well, not pure, you know what I mean. Why do you want me to try it on? Because he's a pretty, pretty princess. That's cause you have. Yes. You stole a very expensive tiara. That's a very expensive item. And it's owned by the company. Like, he has Tiara back. I love those mittens. It's okay, I'm not gonna send you back for a Tiara. Oh, 
I'm inclined to just let her go. As long as she didn't commit the actual murder, obviously. What? Yeah, I'm curious as well. What's in that case? Is it the snake? God, I love that coat. Ooh, I can imagine if they put a magnetic strip around the bottom in the lining, that would perfectly make it close up without ruining the lines with buttons. Do you? Because I'd... I literally have no idea what that has to do with the books on the shelf. Do you? But they're both books are wonky. She has a pet snake, she went in. She might have seen who murdered the friend. strictly forbidden her pets in there is it your pet snake that um, our friend saw I just wanted to see that picture in its full glory. Um, took me a while to get click that one. Why she got a hairband on the end? All that hair that doesn't warrant a hairband, but that one little bit does. Elementary, dear Watts. Oh. And on that not really shocking let's be honest note i'm ending this one and in the next episode we're going to interview this lady and maybe see the snake that if i think i know where it's leading this is the snake that he saw and this is somehow relevant i think she saw some of what was going on before when she went to go get her snake and she left the door open for someone else to get in and kill him. Just my guess for now. I hope you have a very lovely day. And most importantly of all, you do.